Jenny, we're doing like a little balletic movement. Just, as we warm you know, up. stretching like it out. <laughs> just sitting on my butt back in the traffic cave <laughs> for like 10 <laughs> minutes at a time. Just got to stretch it out. Southwest side, we've got a hazmat situation right now. 47th Street, right at Fairfield Ave. So we're being told that apparently a construction crew hit a gas line. So because of that, we've got that level one hazmat again. This is on the southwest side, 47th Street, right at Fairfield Ave. Now from there, let's talk about some crashes, shall we? Southbound Route 53, right at Beasterfield. We've got a crash reported there. Ike continues to be your heaviest travel time, and it's just getting worse. It's an hour and a half heading in. 25th to Western is no fun, no fun at all. Hour and a five to Thorndale. Kennedy, it's an hour 20 inbound. The entire stretch of 90 jammed up. Not much lighter up onto the airport, by the way. Metro, Union Pacific North Line still seeing some really big delays after a person was hit by a train. It happened at about five o'clock this morning. CTA is honoring tickets on the red, purple, and blue line trains. No updates on the condition of that person who was hit. Back to the crashes, Wadsworth, Green Bay Road, right at Wadsworth Road. We still have crews working that one. Mike Kaplan's uh, neck of the woods here, Gurney, Route 132 at Old Grand Ave. We do have a crash there. Uh, over onto the Edens, uh, outbound trip now that is heavier, especially from Montrose to Golf at 40. Stevenson, hour 10, heading in.